had enough force behind it that had it hit further toward the middle of the windshield, it would have came through, and my father was in the passenger seat. Oh, boy, fury and anger from a driver tonight after he says someone flung a rock onto I-465 from a bridge above. It happened this weekend, damaging five cars. I mean, this could have been extremely yeah. dangerous. News aides Camilla Fernandez spoke with police and one of the drivers. There were property damage in this ac this accident, but I'm scared that someone else is going to get really injured. Mark Lytle is sending a warning to drivers after someone dropped a rock from a railroad bridge and hit his car as he drove underneath. He says two other cars also got hit. He says it happened yesterday around noon as he was driving westbound on I-465 near Madison Avenue. I uh, sounded almost like a cannon exploding. Lytle says the rock was about the size of this dog toy. He believes the rock was thrown from above and then it smashed into his car. Flew off of the railroad into the middle of 465 and hit my windshield. His father was in the passenger seat. Luckily, nobody inside the car got hurt. It had enough force behind it that had it hit further toward the middle of the windshield, it would have came through, and my father was in the passenger seat. So I'm thankful that it, it was it hit where it did. He says a trooper told him that this has been going on for some time. Lytle says he would like to see the railroads take action. Whether that is, is fencing along the sides of the railroad or whether it's fencing on the sides to prevent people from climbing up. I'd like to see some sort of action um, and maybe some cameras installed to see if we can't find the perpetrators. Indiana State Police tell me they plan to increase patrols in the area and dispatchers are watching their INDOT cameras. Camilla Fernandez, Wish TV, wishtv.com, and follow us on Facebook.